Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and tonight's video is going to be pretty neat and handy and simple, and it's going to use Control C and Control V, which is copy and paste. If you draw a square that is five inches, and you draw a, and then you want a circle that is five inches, very easily when you have your ratio locked to just type in five inches and now your circle is the exact same size as your square but let's say you have a box and I've ran my decimal places out six times because a lot of times I do that when I'm really working on some detailed work 99.9% um, .9 of the cases it doesn't need but three decimal places but and for the video, I changed it just so it uh, make it easier to understand. So I've got a box that is 5.8346. If I want this to be the same size, I'm going to have to write that number down, and I'm going to have to type it in there. Well, you don't have to do that. Go up here and highlight this. Control. C, go over to your circle, delete that, and go Control V, and then hit Enter, and then hit P, and your circle is 5.85346. That's pretty cool. Uh, saves you a lot of time of remembering numbers, uh, but you have to use Control V and Control C. You can't just try to copy and paste that because um, you get into settings when you try to left click that but anyway try that out see if that doesn't help you in any case not a lot of times I like I said in the other video or said in this previous this video earlier a lot of times having that big a decimal places doesn't really matter and that's very easily changed and I've made a video about that just go to tools options edit and there's your decimal places right there I've got it set on five let's just set it back to three and now you can see my box is 5.853 so if I want a circle I'm gonna hold down my control button just so I got a, a good size circle I'm gonna hit on my box I'm gonna control C Delete this, control V, and then hit enter. And then your circle and your box are the same size. I hope that helped a little bit, and thank you for watching.